loving family so adoring and I love them every day of every week so my son's a little shit my husband's boring and my daughter know what genius is a freak still I help them love each other father brother sister mother cheek to cheek this is completely different it is I mean the New York Times said it's not the feel-good musical, it's the feel-everything musical. And I don't mean just um, loud and big, and it's not that. It's big in, in terms of ideas. It's big in terms of impact. It's big in terms of power. I've worked in musical theater for virtually my entire life, my entire professional life, and it is one of the finest pieces of musical theater that has been written. I feel the same way as I'm preparing for a rehearsal, I'm feeling the same way I felt when I prepared to direct Hamlet, when I prepared to direct Waiting for Godot. This is a show that um, the quality is such that you aspire to it. It's a day that they experiencing trauma, we're talking about it like real people, and we're singing like rock stars on the top of our lungs in each other's faces about it. As I listened to the CD of the original production and as I read it, I was immediately taken with the subject matter, with the score. I've never seen it, so it's, it's, a, it's a very wonderful and kind of scary challenge to direct a play you've never seen. I don't know anybody else's take on it. And it's fun to, to re-discover uh, the role and actually get new insight on it. Um, Carrie, our director, has a whole different take on the role and a whole different take on the piece. Can you keep the cup from tipping? Can you keep your grip from slipping in despair? heightened emotions, the reason why we come to theater, the reflection and the magnification of all of these emotions and experiences, it is, it is the best experience to see and to do. Just another day in the hustle and the hurry, you want to wipe your worry clean away.